as we informed the members of the Council in our letter yesterday, the Armed Forces of the Islamic Republic of Iran launched a series of missile strikes targeting the military and security positions of the Israeli regime. Iran's action was in full accordance with the inherent right to self-defense under Article 51 of the UN Charter and a direct response to the regime's repeated acts of aggression against Iran, including the violation of Iran's sovereignty and territorial integrity during the past months. Iran's missile strike were a necessary and proportionate response to Israeli continued terrorist aggressive acts over the past two months. This includes the violation of Iran's sovereignty, the assassination of political leader of Hamas in Tehran and Iranian citizens, the targeting and wandering Iran's ambassador to Lebanon, and to recent assassination of Sayyid Hassan Nasrullah, the leader of the resistance and secretary general of Hezbollah, and General Abbas Nil Furushan, an Iranian military advisory in Beirut. For a year now, the apartheid and occupying regime of Israel has continued its brutality in occupied Palestine with full impunity. And now this regime is extending its brutal aggressive war to Lebanon and targeting innocent people day and night across the border and deep inside the territory. The regime is pushing the region to the edge of an all-out unprecedented catastrophe. Israel has no intention to pursue peace or a ceasefire.